Hi, it's James here. Uh, today we're going to look at summing amplifiers. So I'm just going to save a project on Proteus as summing amplifier. I'd opened up um, a file that had a lot of op-amp components in it, and I'm just deleting the ones that I don't need. So the summing amplifier takes various inputs and it adds them together. And then I'm going to use a, another op-amp at the end to make the output positive again because it's based on an inverting op-amp. So I'm just changing the plus and minus 15 volt supply rails. I've put four resistors for four different inputs and a feedback resistor. So basically it's an inverting op-amp with four inverting inputs. Now you can use a component called logic state or you can use buttons with 5 volts and pull downs and the way that the circuit works for each of the inputs the gain of that branch is RF over R in or minus RF over R in so that's RF over B and that's RF over A but the minus means it's inverted and the second stage amplifier is just another inverter to put the voltage the right way up again so instead of um, logic states, which are handy, I'm going to use buttons with pull-down resistors so that when the buttons aren't pressed, the input DC, B or A will be zero volts by that ground. And when the button is pressed, they will be made to be five volts. You can use other voltages as well. Just renamed pull down resistor made them low values and I've just assigned a plus 5 volts to the power terminal. Then you can use copy and paste to speed things up a bit. So we have four inputs each with a button. When the button is pressed the input to that branch becomes 5 volts. I highly recommend using LM741 op amps because the generic ones just don't work properly. Then do a Y mirror so that they look more familiar as you normally see them written in questions or for inverting amplifiers. Change the gain of the first feedback resistor because I want a fully true binary output. So I've got A and B give us 3 volts, A, B and C give us 7, and A, B, C, D should give us 15. But we're only getting 14 volts out, so there's a problem somewhere. And the problem is the supply rails to the second op-amp doesn't give us enough swing, because op-amps never go the full swing because some of the voltage is taken up internally. So now I've changed that to 20 volts. We should be able to get 1 volt out, then 2 volts, then 4, then 8. And if we latch the button down, you get 1 volts. 1 plus 2 is 3. 3 plus 4 is 7. 7 take away 1 is 6. 6 plus 8 is 14. With all of them together, we get 15 volts. So this is a summing amp. The first stage just amplifies each input by minus RF over R in, and the second stage inverts it again so that it's back the way it needs to be. Thanks for watching.